Welcome back, guys, to the awesomeness that is the European series. Yes, it's back. Have you missed it? I know some of you have really missed it. Uh, now, I, I was really interested when I, when I came back into this to, uh, to look at the performance and see how it is. And it is it's definitely better. Um, but you've got to bear in mind, our, our population here is huge. So let's just have a look at the population. So let's start off with that. So what are we up to now? Yeah, we're up to like 10,000 <laughs> in Bickety's Hollow. So this is a pretty large population. My God. Yeah. So, yeah. And, uh, and we're, just about, we're just about coping. It is a little bit stuttery, but I can live with that. I can live with that. I can live with that just to look at how freaking incredibly busy all of our train yards are. We've got a lot of trains going around. Now, where were we so long ago? 20, uh, 25, almost 26 billion. <laughs> Crazy amounts of cash. We made like 800, 800, 600 last time. But did we spend? Yeah, we spent a couple of hundred million, so... Yeah, we've been running about the 800 million. I, I want to really get that over a billion. Um, but I've just done a load of housekeeping. And I mean a load of housekeeping. I've spent the last, I don't know, well, at least two hours, um, like, just going through, uh, not there, going through the lines uh, and doing all of the uh, upgrades. Now, I haven't done all of them. I've done virtually all of them. But there are some that I didn't do. And the reason is, and it was mainly like the um, the lines related to the tools, but I've um, but I've updated loads of the others, and I've also added stuff like um, making sure that stuff is assigned to the right type of vehicles and, and things like that. So there was there's a hell of a lot of that to do, uh, and I've done all of that. So there's probably lots and lots of upgrading going on at the moment. I would think lots of upgrading. And let's have a little look. Um, yeah, we've already spent a billion this year on new vehicles. So, yeah, quite a lot of upgrading that needed to be done. Um, wouldn't surprise me if that continued. So, yeah, we're, we're, we're losing half a billion at the moment. But it's all good news. And in actual fact, because we've got newer... Tr we're replacing a lot of old trains. There are a lot of old trains. I mean, some of them are like 120 years old. Uh, and they're getting replaced with new ones, which means that they'll make, they'll make more profits now that they've been replaced. Right, what are we going to do in this episode? I thought we would kind of ease ourselves back into this series. Um, and like I said, I want to get over, I want to be making a billion a year. So I thought, how about we start here and we look, where are we losing money? Now, the Jackson Freight Yard line, I don't know whether you, uh, whether you caught the live stream, but um, that's where we've got the, the fake trains. Yeah, they're all on the on the Jackson Freight Yard line, um, so ignore that one because that, like that's just it is what it is. But look at this, sector three and sector four, the fuel lines and also the uh, construction materials, but particularly the fuel are losing us like a fair amount of money. I mean that's like they're losing us 40, 40 million a year, like straight away. I mean let alone like making a profit. So I think we should do something about that. So let's um, let's turn on a few icons, shall we? Right, now, where can we get fuel from? Well, there's like actually quite a few places that we could get fuel from. Now, if, um, if we look at those lines, let's have a look, where are we? Do, 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 do. We want, uh, let's bring up Halo Sector 3 fuel and Halo Sector 4 fuel. Right, so, uh, these, these two lines uh, meet here. So this is where we've got to get fuel to. And if um, if we if we bring up the icons for stations and uh, bus and tram stops, oh, with stations. Here we go. You can see there's um, there's no fuel here. There's fuel at the other, at the other ends of the line. So there's there's fuel up here. Uh, yeah, there. Yeah, you can see the fuel going on. We've got fuel over there. We've got fuel some down somewhere down here. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, we've got fuel here. No fuel going on here. So I thought we get some fuel going. Now, um, the question is, where the hell do we get it from? Oh, that's not the right place here. We've got to get the fuel to here. Now, there's, there's one over there that we could use. There's one over there. There's one over there. The thing is, I'd re I, I would love to use, like, there's, now there's an, there's an oil. Uh, there's an oil well there. I'd, I'd kind of love to use this to have 
vehicles going backwards and forwards and it would be kind of cool to have trains coming in and out of the yard the freight yard that would be kind of cool too so that was where i was originally thinking of doing something um so should we do it should we make it happen let's make it happen what the hell okay let's pause things i was was i running on things on times three speed i think i was running things on times three speed then yeah maybe i wasn't i don't know whichever anyway let's um let's get this done so we want uh we want to be picking oil up from here now where's the where's the entrance the entrance is here i think um uh, so we could use i mean we could use one of these we've got like not like four of these that we could use um i don't know i'd, I'd kind of like to maybe turn one around and to be honest uh, do, 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 do. How, do we do, how do i do this because i want to get the trucks onto onto this road asap uh, so that they can go up here to this now <laughs> we do have this kind of big cliff up here and you can see that the height of this is nowhere near the height of this so we're gonna have to do something there oh uh, you know what should we not worry about the efficiency of this and just do something that's kind of a bit cool or try, like try like oh you go let's let's try let's try let's see if we can't do something that's like a little bit cool so now is this a large country road or is it, i think this is a large yeah it's a large now i wonder like can we do like a a, a curvy road going up here maybe now if we if we kind of raise you up a little bit and bring you in a little bit like this kind of thing now, now how steep is that because we do, like if we're going for the aesthetic then we don't want it to be too steep that's kind of interesting so now which way uh actually we probably want to go that way don't we rather than going that way all right well let's do that then so let's go let's go that way Ooh, this should create a nice steep cliffside as well is kind of cool right we want to be going like pretty much dead straight don't we let's let's bring it back to about what do we think yeah, about there yeah maybe about there all right let's let's take that yeah i'm, I'm liking this idea i'm liking this idea right so then we want to go up the hillside like this just go straight up here like that like now how far do we want to go I I think we want to come out like oh now that then it turns into a turns into a bridge which you don't mind quite happy with a bridge and then if we have a, a loop there and then go up there yeah right let's take that Oh, this is this is a good idea. Now we do have this stupid blooming thing in the way, so I am thinking that maybe we bring a road out, something like this. Uh, oh, I'm gonna have to cancel this and go back in so it does something sensible. If we come out like that and then have a bit of a tunnel, so take you down. Ooh, that's as far down as it'll go. Will you, oh, you will make a tunnel. All right. All right. So, if we had a tunnel coming... Now, I wonder if we could have that tunnel come... Oh, we might be able to. Yeah. If we could have that tunnel coming out in this direction. Uh, let's go down. So, we want that coming out in this kind of direction, don't we? If something like that would work. Okay, tell you what. Let's put that in, but I'm going to replace this bit. So that it's um, not quite so steep. So let's take that back and have a more, a more gentle approach to that. Uh, that's straight, isn't it? Now, if I drop that down, yeah, we no. I want something different than that. Um, let's let's try that again. If we bring you like straight out. And let's play around with this. See, it's this is curving up. No, we don't want that. We don't want that. We want to take this back a, t a fraction, I think, because it's 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 coming up at such a steep steep angle 
Um, now, if I ah, that's that's pretty much perfect. That's pretty much perfect. I think. Right. Let's let's cancel that and get back in. So it's reset. Right. So if we did something like maybe that, that's much better, much smoother. I might even come out a bit further than that. Now, I guess we're going to have a single loop that goes around and into there. So we want this to be, I don't know, maybe like that. Cha-ching. Oh, yeah. I am, I am liking how this is working. So... Now, if I just bring this out straight till it's level with that. Yeah. So, let's bring you out straight till you're level with that. So, about there. And then loop you around like that. How does that work? Oh, that works. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what do you think, guys? Oh, I like that. And we're going to have trucks rolling up and down here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm liking it. Uh, it's still, it is still a bit laggy. But like I said, this is a pretty massive place now. And there's so much going on. I can't, couldn't believe how many trains and vehicles we've got. I mean, there are, I don't know, I get that. there are hundreds and hundreds of them. If not thousands of vehicles now. Uh, right, so we want a depot. Uh, now, where are we going to have the depot? Now, yeah, it's actually a little bit tricky. I think if we get rid of this road, maybe, and then hook that up with another... Well, no, I didn't want that. Hook that up with another large road. Yeah, like... Oh, oh. See, it's going to do something horrible there. That's the only thing. Uh, can I get it to not do something? No, it's, it's going to do something. Like, whatever I do, it's going to do something horrible there. Yeah. You know, what about if I use if I give if, if I use a medium country road? The the reason um, I replaced that road was because I was going to put the depot onto there, but I suppose I could try and hook it into that corner there. Um, at least that's like just about reasonable. Um, I, let's say I took that right. Could I? In, and I'll just, it's just occurred to me, if I run it the other way, maybe, I might get a better result. If I run the road from there, I'm, nah, I'm not going to get a better result. Uh, if I ran it from, maybe from there, nah, it wants to be out, out there, doesn't it, to get a straight road. Alright, well, let's do that. And then we'll try and put something in. So what do I want? I want our freight, and what do I want? Um, do I want an industrial one like this? I think, I don't know, I'm thinking like a city one would look better. Now if I flip you around, can I get you to hook onto there? The answer is, no I freaking can't. Oh, come on. Uh, this is a small city. Okay, will that hook onto there? Oh, oh, come on. No, you won't. No, you won't. Okay, right. Well, in that case, I'm going to have to go back to plan A, and I think we're going to have to have a janky bit there, which, yeah, which is a bit of a shame, but really too much I can do about it. If I go in the other way, does it work any better? I don't think it will. Nah, it's always going to give us that janky bit. All right. Well, let's live with it. So, oh, so, like, really? Now you won't put something? Oh, come on. It's always the thing that you think is going to be like reasonably easy that turns out to be freaking ridiculously hard. Um, I could move that. Let's do that. Let's take that out. Let's get the, this bit of road in the way we want it. So we want this bit of road like that. I think that's probably about as good as it's going to be. And then... Yeah, if we take that back, maybe one more section. And we'll do, you know what? Well, this is a kind of a temporary hookup anyway, so let's just hook that up to there and out to there. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so let's go back to trying this. So, oh, you still want to hook up to that corner, but we can we can just put it in there. Now, if I'm going to do that, I might as well go for the 
medium one. So if we flip you around, kind of like that kind of thing, and have you there. Okay. So this is the oil refinery, kid. So now what are we going to do down here is the question. Uh, and I'm thinking we go for the same thing. Use one of these larger ones and flip you around like that kind of thing and have you in there. But then I'm wondering, should I put a larger road in here? And to be honest, I think for just a very small bit, I don't think it really makes any difference. It's only the speed limit I'm kind of worrying about, really. Let's turn you around a little bit. Like, um, yeah, I think having you straight actually looks better. So let's have you like there, shall we? Cha-ching. I, I, I've got to say, I really like this little layout. It's a real shame that... I'm going to have to change this because this is going to get bigger and it's going to put extra buildings and stuff here. So all of this is going to have to change. <laughs> oh, and after all the fun I had putting that in. Yeah, well. Right, so we want some vehicles now for this. Do we not? Yes, we do. Now that's going to bring the fuel back to here. Uh, potentially. Now the question is, if we bring the fuel to there... Uh, see, if we bring the fuel to there, it's not going to be in range of, like, some kind of train station. If we wanted to ship the fuel out from here. Um, bum, 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 bum. Now, we could get the vehicles to come over this. See, if we use this one, then we could maybe put in a station here. Ew, that's that's kind of an interesting idea. Um, so if we were going to if we were going to do this, and we'd only need like a, a single platform, wouldn't we? Like potentially, um, we could have that in somewhere, somewhere like that. All right, tell you what, let's um, whip out a bit of this track. Bosh and bosh. Now we want a three twenty station, don't we? So. It's going to be at least that big, I would have thought. So, look. We want uh, one platform, 320, high speed, catenaries, yes. Second straight connection, no. Now, the question is, can we get it in? <laughs> yeah. And that's going to be... It's going to be tricky. I think we're going to have to lose... Yeah, we'd, we'd have to lose this line. Yeah... Well, we have to lose part of that line, but we don't necessarily have to lose all of it. Okay, tell you what, if we take out like that and that, yeah, maybe one more section, right? Then if we had this there, cha-ching, which is kind of nice because it adds another building in here. We can have a little road hooking up to there, that's fine. And then, this bit of track here, we can make that just hook onto here. Uh, and it doesn't have to be fancy, does it? Just hook on there. Too, oh, too much slope. Too much slope? What the hell are you talking about? Too much slope. Don't test me. Don't test me, game. Oh, there we go. That'll work. Okay, cool. Excellent. Um, so, yeah, now what we want to do is we want to upgrade this line so that we've got high speed and catenaries. It's obviously going to be a bit slow coming through here, but again, this is more for the aesthetics than anything. So, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. So let's have, what do we want? What do we want? We want to upgrade and we'll do the catenaries first. So we'll have catenaries on there. And we need a route in, so that bit and that bit and now, ha, huh. okay, fine. Uh, how the hell are we going to handle this? And what I'm thinking is, uh, what I was thinking of doing was having some kind of tunnel. 
Now, how are we going to get in here? I think there's a free... Yeah, there's, a, there's one free platform. This platform is free. The, uh, that one's used. So we'd, we'd be coming into that platform. So we could have, like, there's plenty of space here to have a tunnel uh, and then come into that platform. The, the question is, how the hell would we get a tunnel in at this end? Let's take that out. Uh, take that and that and that out. Okay, and then we'll have a little, little smooth. A little smooth it. There we go. Alrighty. Uh, we also need to, before I forget, make this high speed. So, uh, all of this needs to be upgraded to high speed. So there, and this bit through. Oh, that little bit there. And this bit around there. And you know what we'll do? We'll, we'll make this a a frequently used line, so we'll make that all high speed. And that hooks into there. Now obviously I could put I could let these trains go onto this line and use this line. Um I mean I mean we could, but I just I don't I just don't really want to. I want this to be I want this to be separate. Uh, now I could, I could potentially take this, like, well, I could take this onto this line, and then maybe run a track going across there, and then and then go have a tunnel in that. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. So that is the track done, signals done. Right, let's get a line going. We want line manager, new line. This is going to be, what's this going to be? This is going to be the, it's going to be like the, the Jackson, the Jackson, uh, Jackson fuel line. There we go. And we want to run you from, let's see. Uh, from where is it come on here it is from that station to uh, bum, 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 bum. yeah to there oh yes excellent all right let's put that over there now we do want another line because we've got the truck line to do as well god that seems so long ago <laughs> um yeah and i said yeah, we're probably going to use... I think we're going to have... Well... Do we use this one? I mean, we could probably use any of these. I suppose I need to put that little road in first, don't I? Yeah, so that we know what the hell we're doing. So let's put that little road in there. Bosh. Uh, so, that's in range. It's not... I've got to say, it's not... A, is that in range? Oh my god, that's actually in range. Um, 
yeah, it goes up to there. So, all right, we'll well, yeah, we'll use that one then. Yeah, we'll use that one. That's fine. Okay, so what do we want? We want uh, this to run from there to there. Let me just zip up and down. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want it doing that. Oh, I want you to go round that way. And the thing is, with truck routes, you can't force it to not do that. The only way to stop it doing that is to, is, would be to like break the connection here, which I could do. Uh, is there another way that I could do this? Bump, 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 bump. Not, not really that I can think of. I mean, yeah, I mean, I, could, I guess I could take that road out there, maybe. I, I kind of like how this is laid out, though. That's that's kind of annoying. Um, I could, I don't know. I, mean, like, I could take a section out like that, and then it forces it to go that route. I think that's what we're going to have to do for now, because, yeah. Yeah, well, that's what we're going to have to do for now. Right, we uh, we need uh, some vehicles. Do, 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 do. Now, these, I've got six million depots along here, and I'm just wondering, is there any way for those vehicles to actually get to the lot? And I don't think there is, because that goes all the way down here. That, so that's not connected. That's not connected. That's not, I'm going to have to put another one in. <laughs> uh, look at it. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 vehicle depots, and I can't use any of them. Oh, classic. Well done, Sky. Yeah, so we'll have one down here. I think maybe we'll have one there. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. So what do we want? Depot. So if we flip you around and have you... Oh, I need to come around just... So if we have you like that, cha ching. Yeah, I don't know what I, I think we should have something around it. I don't know, like I don't know whether it's like a little road around it and something. Definitely needs something around it. I'll think about that. By road vehicles. This is gonna be Oh now we could have these Volvo tankers. Oh hell yeah. Volvo tankers it is. Now, um, colour. Should we have? I wonder what red tankers would look like. Like bright red tankers. Do I have bright red tankers or like blue tankers? Maybe dark blue tankers or something like that. I don't know. Now, I tell you what, I'm going to have a plane. I'm just going to take a plane for now, and then we'll maybe play around with the colours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Well, we're certainly going to want twelve, and I'm thinking we're going to want more than that. Uh, 13, 14, 15, 16. Because it's, it's a fair old run. And 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. <laughs> I don't care. I want loads of trucks running around here, so it's fine. What do I want? Uh, set them all on... You know, what line was it? Can you remember? It's got to be... Oh, it's line 14, apparently. So there you go. You're on line 14. Okay, so that's that. Now we need to get a couple of trains on here. Now, for this, we can use this. Uh, it is electrified, so yeah, we can get the trains out. All right. I'm thinking, how many trains? I, don't, I, I suppose, actually, because we've done the tunnel, it's not really that far, but we have got these slow bits. Yep. Yeah. Three, should we start off with three trains and see how it goes? Let's do three trains and see how it goes. So, where are you? Uh, so you're going to be coming out of this one. So, by trains. We want, and yes, I know I'm going to be boring and I'm just going to use my boring class 185. Well, let's see, there's 185. I don't think there's any point going for a 103. So I think we're going to stick with a 105, 185. I really like the 185s. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be boring. 185 with oh, I've got so many so many tank wagons to choose from. Uh, but I'm gonna go with the the ordinary one. Uh, the, I I need to look at some of these other ones and see uh, should I be maybe using some of these some of these other ones. But some of them are maybe a bit cheaty. 
Oh, I don't know how you feel about that, but I suppose I could mix it up a bit. See, like this. See, this has got a capacity of 15. This has got a capacity of 30. Um, but it's only got a top speed of 75. That's got a top speed of 99. There's all kinds of different things. Um, the weight, this is like 49 tons. This is only 15. So, you know, maybe this one's actually kind of like reasonably balanced. Um, this one, 75 miles an hour, 24. These are all the same. 75 miles an hour, 24. And that one, and that one. And that one, and that one. Yeah, they're all the same. Uh, you know, for now, I won't mess around. I'll just go with these. So this is just fuel, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll set them to just carry fuel. Oh, good Lord. Try that again, you idiot. Uh, tank wagon, just fuel. Right, and we want up to 320. So take one of those off. There we go. Right, we are going to want... I said three, didn't I? three going to be enough or do we want four i'm seriously you know what i'm gonna go four what the hell one two three four it's not like i haven't got money <laughs> so what am i worrying about jackson fuel line jackson fuel line boom oh unable to find path to stop so yeah i think it's that little bit there yeah it needs to be electrified so where are we yeah Okay, I didn't want to do that. I was trying to click on that. Let's get rid of that. Come on, signal. Thank you. And uh, what I want upgrade. Yeah, it's just that little bit there, I think. Right. Uh, yeah, and the doors are open now. And here come. Oh, now I've got to set them on the line because they won't go on the line until it's working. Jackson fuel line. Hooray! And here they come. Now, hang on a second. I've got the line up, but the line isn't showing up. Why isn't the line showing up? Okay, I've, after a lot of looking, I eventually found it. And it's, um, it's a bit of catenary that I missed, which is, it's two, it's two little bits of catenary where, oh, and now I've lost them again now. <laughs> oh, here we go. Look, it's one little bit there. Ah, see, that line's gone in now, and, and that line's gone in. Oh, there we go. God, one tiny little bit. Oh, that messed me up. Right, let's go back to our train. So, you, oh, you're not going to come out of there, are you? Okay, let, let me get rid of that signal there. Ah, there we go. That's got you. Alrighty, now this is a, that's a 30 mile an hour bend there. So it's, it's actually, have a look at the, there we go. Yeah, so you can see that's like a 30, 30 mile an hour bend there. So it's going to be going very slowly through there. This is like 23, 23 miles an hour. Mind you, I think that's that bit. I don't know, it could be this bit. I don't know, we've got an auto save going on. Right, go away. Auto so. Yeah, we've got lots of like thirties and But that's cool. Like I said, I want the trains going through slowly through here. So yeah, from a profitability perspective, yeah, not the greatest thing in the world. I'm glad I put the fourth train on. Right, so you're gonna come down into now is the next train gonna try and come out or is it gonna wait there? Um I suppose it wouldn't oh pause. Uh, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea. To put a signal in there. Ah, that's pushed it onto that line. Ha ha ha. Right. So, now you're on the wrong line. Okay, well, in that case, you turn around, go that way. There you go. Well, that's got rid of you at least. Oh, that, that brought out the next train. <laughs> um, yeah, you're going to have to turn around as well. And go... Oh, no. Oh, it's, it's pushed all the trains out. Yeah, you need to turn around as well. Oh, where are you? You. Oh, 
turn around and you turn around there we go man rather convoluted but it's okay and this train's managing to drive through these two trades that's impressive You're going to go on your merry way. Right, let's go and, let's go and follow our trucks. Right, because I want to have a... Oh, look at these things. Oh, and they're sky. Sky oil. <laughs> oh, dear. That look, That's so weird. Let's see my logo on there. I've got to get my new logos on. I've definitely got to get my new logo. So they come in here and hopefully pick up some stuff. And then let's follow them. So we'll follow Road Vehicle 220. Off we go. Look, isn't this good? I mean, that looks... I can't, Lord, it's so real. So, up onto the bridge that goes all the way across our freight yard. We'll have to get some other traffic on here somehow. Now, people have been moaning at me for running games like too fast, so I'm, well, I'm going to keep it on, I guess, one time speed for a bit. I'm glad I got those ramps in. They don't, I've got to say, they, they're not the, like, it'd be nice if they matched on both sides, but at least we got the ramps in. So we could, I mean, we could have vehicles going down here. I need to put some vehicle routes and get vehicles like zipping across all over the place. Oh, here we go. This is the bit that I've been wanting to see going up this windy road so our oil tanker goes around here by the cliff goes up the cliff road it's very quiet this truck does this truck not have sound I don't think this truck's got sound Doesn't seem like it, does it? Oh, that's a shame. It's not quite the same without sound. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's the sound of a train or something. Yeah, there's a train going over there. Yeah, these dump... They, apparently, they, there's no sound files attached to these trucks. God, okay, that's pretty freaking steep coming up there. We might, I might have to do something about that. Uh, so, as I say, have you got... No, you've got nothing. You've got... Now, is this pro even producing? L we've got line usage, yes. But we obviously haven't got any fuel shipped up here, up here yet. So, let's have a look. Line usage... Production zero? How can production be zero? We've got line usage. How come you're not producing oil over here? Oh, man. Now what's wrong? Let's get rid of those. Now I've got to figure out what the hell is wrong with this. You are definitely in range of that. Oh, we, oh, we've got some. We've got some crude. So why are you saying production zero? We've got some crude there. For line 14, which is what these vehicles are on. So, we, yeah, that's got some crude. Oh, did you start and then you've stopped? Let's have a look. Yes, it started and then it stopped. Why have you stopped? It's kind of weird. I guess it's reached it, its limit. So these vehicles have got to start bringing that stuff up here. You haven't got any yet. You got any? Oh, you've got one. Oh, there you go. Hooray. We've got some now. These obviously need to space out a bit, which would be nice. But, oh, and now we've got fuel. Yes, we're producing fuel. Hooray. <laughs> okay, so that worked. So we are producing fuel. The fuel's going to get taken down. So let's see. So we've got, got one of our trains coming in here now. So should we have a, I don't know, should we have a first person ride maybe? 
Oh, let's have a first person ride on this. Because that's going to be nice. Or oh, it should be. Look at this. Isn't it beautiful? Now, okay, yeah, it's, it's probably going to be a little bit stuttery. But when you consider how much is going on, look at these tank cars, how good they are. Oh, now the sound's come back. I wonder what the hell happened to the sound. It's, it's so much better with the sound, isn't it? I keep saying, isn't it? God, seriously, I wish you were sitting here now. Like the two of us could be going, look at that, look at this, what about that bit? Look at that bit over there. I keep spotting little signs and stuff on the buildings and all kinds of nonsense. This view is so good down down this river valley. The, the cities look so good. Yeah, some of this track is a little bit janky, I suppose, but I think we'll live. Oh, I love all these lines crossing. It's awesome. Well, that was going at a decent pace. And then we're down into the very long tunnel, which, which let's face it, is kind of boring. It's one of the reasons that I don't like tunnels. Um, because the thing, the problem with tunnels is you can't see the trains. What's, what's the point? <laughs> what's the point? If you can't see the trains, it's kind of no fun. Oh, so, yeah. This is... And this is kind of a fairly long run. But well, we're getting up to 86 miles an hour, 87, 90. I don't know what the top speed is on this train, actually. Yeah, there's another one of the trains coming, zipping by. Skystorm. Skystorm oil. Are we there yet? <clears throat> Are we there yet? Come on. Oh, and we've hit max speed, 99 miles an hour. That's the limit of our trucks. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna jump out of there. I think because it's, <laughs> it's it's a bit boring being in that tunnel. Uh, come on, you. Let's speed you up to get you out of that tunnel. And he completes the journey. Slips into here, and eventually we'll be delivering some some fuel. Now, with a bit of luck. If I zip back here, we should be starting to see oil, uh, fuel, appearing down here. Now, have you just picked up some fuel? Yes. Only two, but you know what? That's fine. And it looks like we've got the spacing on our trains just about right. Oh, that's coming in just as that's going out. And yeah, the track works. Oh, peachy. Very peachy. Our trucks are spacing out, so they're not... Yeah, our trucks are nicely spaced out. I think I've got that number just about right, actually. So what's our production at? 64. I tell you what, shall I let it run on for like, I don't know, a little... Yeah, I'll let it run on for a little bit so that you can see what it's doing. Well, that took me a little bit of time. I had some issues getting the uh, getting the production to run smoothly on these two, but you can see we uh, we are getting fuel into these stations now. These are now up at their 400 level and staying up there. Th there is some kind of issue though because um, these are saying like upgrading in six or seven months. We're just going to the first of the of the new month, uh, and this time they've upgraded. But th these have been taking it's been taking like three or four months to get one month up. It's been really weird, but it's now starting to actually work quite well. And I've changed the setup slightly. Um, where are we? Over here. I've changed the setup slightly uh, with the trucks. I've broken it into into two lines so that we're using both of these uh, both of these platforms. And I've put a bunch more vehicles on. So uh, so this is Jackson Field Two. And yeah, where are you? No, oh, that's Jackson Field Two. Jackson Field One. So let's just have a quick look at these before we wrap up. And so you can see we've got a fair old number of vehicles on here because I wanted loads of vehicles running around. I'm kind of tempted to 
you know what I should do? What I should do is make one of these sets of vehicles. You know what? Let's uh, let's replace these. Uh, replace. Yeah, no, in fact, cancel. Uh, if I go to vehicles, no. Uh, if I go to, uh, oh, good lord, what do I? Where can I change the color? Oh, here we go. Because I had these red, and red doesn't show up. They look exactly the same. Let's change into blue. There we go. Now we can see which ones are which. Excellent. So you can see that, um, yeah, we're now up to the 400 limit. Look, we've gone from we've gone from January to February. Let, let me crank this up so you can see. I bet it does it this month as well, just just to spite me. But it's been it. Well, you can see it's taken years. I mean, we've run on about 20 years just to get them up to the 400 level. It's taken ages. Crazy amounts of time, but. Hopefully, it's working now. They are both maxed out at the 400 limit. Before, that, I was having all kinds of issues. But I think with this with this new two-line setup, everything seems to be working a hell of a lot better now. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's actually ticked up. Okay, well, this seems to... Having run in the two lines seems to have fixed it. Cool. Excellent. Good news. And we're starting to produce decent amounts of fuel over here. Come on, come on, deliver some more fuel, damn you. Here we go there, that's more like it. And then that's getting shipped out and it's appearing on the lines over here. So what's that doing for us? Well, you probably saw that we've hit the billion mark. We uh, we hit the billion mark in 2113. We're making a billion a year. Unbelievable. 1.04, 1.06. So it's still going up. And if we look at our line profitability now, uh, we can see that now where's oh here's Halo fuel sector four, and it's only losing like four million, and oh and that's gone. Oh uh, yeah, there's uh, there's Halo sector three fuel, which is only losing twelve million now, and that's uh, that should rapidly start turning a profit. So the next thing we're going to have to look at is um, let's see Halo sector two and three construction materials, and it's going to be exactly the same issue. Uh, but we'll get that set up. But I, whether we'll do that in the next episode, I don't know. Because I tell you what I'd really like to do. I'd really like to get some ships going. Don't you think it would be nice to have some uh, some ships running around? Let's turn some of these things off. I think it's nicer to look at the look at the map when there's none of that stuff going on. This is all starting to look very cool. And of course now we've got trains running through here. Looks so much better when you've actually got some movement in here. There needs to be a lot more movement in here. We need to have, I don't know, some trucks running around and stuff like that. I will get that done. It is all going to happen eventually. It's going to take ages, but <laughs> but that's the fun. I don't mind it taking ages. We've now got activity. I am loving it. All right, guys, we will leave it there for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. What's what's the production up to? Uh, are, we, are we close? Well, we're upgrading in three months. See, look, that's... That's gone from four months to three months. Uh, April, May, June. It's taken like two or three months to go one month up. Uh, it's weird. I don't know why. I don't know why it's doing that, but but it is. So you know, and let's face it, it doesn't really matter. The important thing: we've hit the billion. <laughs> Sweet. I will catch you for the next episode. Peace out, guys.